I want you to look. The mountain is there to the north. This is all of Israel. North is high and it goes down south. Okay? The Temple Mountain, the same. What you see in here, 100 times bigger was the Temple Mountain. Got it? But here, it had been left. For then, Jerusalem is everything. When you hear, you don't hear about Pharaoh, although it's much older and it's a man. Abraham chose it here first, okay, and, and whatever. And David was in here first. But you don't hear about it. Jerusalem is always in the picture. Bethlehem is always in the picture. The rest, as if it doesn't exist. He said, my sanctuary, no chisel, no iron should touch. Remember? We are inside the wall. And this, all of those homes in David's time. This is the city of David. In a pepper. The room that divided into one, two, three rooms, this colonnade. Okay? This is typical the house of David system. That's their style. So today when I find a four-room building, I know, ah, of course, I can do today four-room building too. But I'm talking about that, that time. Davidic. This is the property that Abraham bought. The very soon I'll show you why. Okay? That complex over there is the true tomb of the temple. Two in here, two in here, mm. and two in here. The same as what we saw. Mm -hmm. Oh, the same way out. Yeah. giant complex in here and this is the true burial place of the patriarch. Yeah, you understand? Mm -hmm. Actually we are in the upper room above the tomb that is underneath down below us. You, you follow me? Mm -hmm. Okay and it was all underground. Where will I show you that that's it the case? When we'll be later on in Jerusalem we have other places that Sachi just finished to build, my friend, and this is the burial place of Rabbi Simon. I'm very glad that I've been able to bring you in. This was excavated just six months ago. Yeah, yeah, and still not finished. the land beyond it? The land of God. It's not the promised land. It's God's land. Over there, deep into the desert, we do have a place that's called Mount Sinai. And it's the Mount of God, where God gave the Ten Commandments in the hand of Moses. Remember? And this is the essence all the Bible teaching. That's it. We are in the Be'er Shiva Valley. Although this town used to be like a garden. See? Right there. And it's a little bit excavated here. So you are able to see if you go off some.
over there is where we came from, south of Hebron Mountain, right? Over there. And we are right now in the Beersheba Valley. This is the journey of the 12th time. This is the journey of David. This is the journey of Solomon. This is the journey of our Lord. This is the journey of the prophets. Okay? All of them went to Mount Horeb, which is Mount Sinai. makes fire and fire will keep you alive. I understand that and fire is the sacrificial and whenever you see this kind of flint stone okay all around you understand that something important is in here 